week of practice. Minnesota, as we mentioned, with the full squad. Talking to Kelly Flanagan, she said, yeah, a lot of energy, and you know, it's a confident team, obviously. There's a chance and a goal! Snodgrass found that puck, beats Schroeder, and how about Minnesota grabbing the one nothing lead in the first? Taking advantage of opportunities, Goldie. That's what we saw here. Snodgrass, head on a swivel, was ready for that one. And Schroeder just didn't look like she had time to adjust to the play. And that's what happens. That's how you beat good goaltenders is with plays like this. And the puck just ricochets off the end wall. Caught Schroeder by surprise. And actually, she saw it coming. Tried to get her stick or blocker on. But Boston clearly has, you know, picked up the intensity and you know that puck possession work now a chance in front off the turnover and they answer right back and score and Minnesota able to reclaim the lead two to one and that's Stephanie Anderson scoring for the Minnesota Whitecaps and that's a huge response goal again you can't let this boss less than a minute to go the cross ice pass didn't connect but Albers able to keep it alive in the offensive zone Snodgrass fires Schroeder with a big save. Rebound set in front and they score! It finds its way in, and Minnesota's not done yet. It's a one goal game with 48 seconds to go. Hard work pays off. They were grinding in the offensive zone, keeping plays alive, extending them, moving skaters around. I mean, nobody was standing still on that last sequence, Goldie, and they are rewarded with a big goal here to make it just a one goal game. So Shepherds gets the goal, and now the scramble off the draw to the corner. Whitecaps get it in behind the net. Sent up high, the shot of the slot, score! They did it! Two goals with the goaltender on the bench in the final minute. And Baldwin has tied this game at four with 17 seconds to go. Wow. What a treat we've had in this game, Goldie. What a great hockey game potential playoff matchup it is not disappointing and what great work by the Whitecaps there was a lot of bodies in this shooting lane and in front of Schroeder I don't know if she saw that she had Flanagan right in front of her and she kind of reacted late to the shot